Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Aloy and welcome back to yet another Minecraft mod tutorial. As you guys might have noticed by now, Microsoft got rid of Fire Explorer. And while everyone is searching for a new method for getting mods on the Xbox One, I thought I'd start to branch out. However, before you click off this video Xbox owners, this is a prerequisite step to the method I currently have discovered for you guys, so you might want to stick around. And if you don't have a Windows 10 PC, don't worry, I'll have a guide going up for all you iOS users and Android users real soon. But if you came here for what the video title says, you're also in luck because this is the most efficient way to get mods or add-ons on your Windows 10 device. Anyways, enough small talk for now guys, you know the drill, make sure to leave a like, share, and subscribe if you're new for all sorts of Minecraft Bedrock Edition related content, and without further ado guys, let's get into the guide already. So first things first, you're going to want to head to this website, it's mcpedl.com. Now, if you stuck around for all of the Xbox One tutorials and Xbox One days, you probably are well aware of this website. It's basically the number one place to get mods, maps, and add-ons for uh, Bedrock Edition. Now, of course, we'll be using this because, you know, there's just such a high selection of mods to select from. But anyways, what you want to do once you get to mcpedl.com is go over to the mods tab and hit A on it and then just go into add-ons. Now, you can choose any of them that you want. There's so many different pages, but we'll just do a super basic one that I saw earlier, which is the Roblox Jumping Animation Add-on. Now, this one's kind of cool because, you know, it's just, it affects your player. It doesn't change too much, so I can showcase it at the end just to prove that it works. But anyways, what you want to do is once you get into the mod that you want, the first thing that you want to check for is the supported Minecraft versions. Make sure it's the most updated version, which right now is 1.14, but this guide should work from now until the end of time, basically. But then you'll want to look for downloads, which is right here. And this one's kind of cool. Instead of taking you to like Mediafire, it takes you and just immediately downloads it. But some of them will take you to like Mediafire or like AdFi. Just skip the ads and just download it just the normal way. But anyways, what you want to do once you download it is just open up the mod or application that you just installed so open it up like that by hitting the arrow and hitting open and as you guys can notice it'll actually open up windows 10 down here and once you open windows 10's minecraft it should say up at the top uh importing mod or an successfully imported robux or whatever mod you guys chose to do so to prove that this works no cuts hit a on play create a new world Creating a new world, name the world, whatever I want, I guess. And what you want to do is then go down to add-ons and then just find the packs and find the mod that you just installed, which was the Roblox one for me. And then sometimes you could check behaviors, sometimes it won't even be on there. Now, another thing you might want to check when you're on mcpedl.com is to see if this mod requires experimental gameplay. However, it doesn't look like this one does, so we should be all good. So let's get back on this, and then we can just create the world. Now, I'll get back to you guys as soon as this world is created, just because it could take some time because of the mod, never mind. Never freaking mind. Anyways, let's go like this and let's see. Yep, we got it. Let's go, guys. We got the Roblox jumping animation. That's so cringe, but whatever. Just as you guys could see, it worked. And it's so cool. Now, as I stated earlier, this will be a prerequisite for the all or just like the Xbox One method. So, uh,. Yeah, just definitely make sure to follow the steps. And if you came for Windows 10, definitely stick around because we do so much stuff on Minecraft Bedrock. There will be so much more guides on this. Anyways, guys, that's going to wrap it up for the video. If you enjoyed, make sure to leave a like, share, subscribe if you're new for all sorts of Minecraft Bedrock Edition related content. And uh, without further ado, guys, I'll see you in the next video. Peace out, you freaking nerds.